Fans love the atmosphere and excitement of a Florida State football game. But sitting through three hours of Mother Nature's elements isn't always for everyone. Al and Judy Dunlap's many contributions to FSU are well known. The new Champions Club is the latest culmination of their generosity. The club offers seat holders the opportunity to enjoy the complete game experience, inside and out. It's incredible. It's high-end amenities, obviously. People can come in here and enjoy the food and beverage. They have a great social experience while they're in here talking to their friends. We've got televisions, we've got good air condition here. Everything is just first-rate all the way. The Champions Club isn't the only first-rate experience Al and Judy have created for FSU. Their many contributions will ensure the Knolls are well cared for on and off the field. They allow them participate in the best facilities, practice, have the uh, best training, uh, and, w and whenever they are ill or injured, uh, the best rehab they can possibly have. We do these things because we believe it's the right things to do. We don't do it to get our name on a building. We do it to help young people. We were both born to extremely humble beginnings, and we worked very, very hard to achieve what we did, and to finally have the ability to do these things is so gratifying and makes all the hard work worth it. Neither Al nor Judy attended Florida State. So what drives their love for FSU? I was doing a speaking tour for the major colleges in America like Wharton, Harvard, Yale, Princeton, and someone said, would you speak at Florida State? And I said, Florida State, where the hell is that? But what we came, we left that long weekend so impressed by the students, the faculty, the coaches, and we said, this is a fantastic institution that we want to be part of. And about 22 years ago, Judy had an idea for the best way to share their good fortune. I said, well, we do some things now while we're alive and we can enjoy it. And it's the best thing we ever did. So we sat down and decided what's important to us. It was education, medicine, and the humane society animals. And since then, the Dunlops have donated more than $20 million to the university. That money has gone towards improving student success, enhancing athletic facilities, and creating the ultimate fan experience. I don't think there's anything like it uh, in a college football stadium in America that I have seen. We're very proud of it, and uh, we're, we're really happy for our fans who come here and cheer on the Seminoles. With the School of Business, the uh, naming of the Champions Club and being the lead sponsor on the indoor practice facility, we've added facilities that not only enhance our revenue to help provide athletics, which is the job of the boosters, but also directly help football and the School of Business achieve higher levels. Al and Judy Dunlap's generosity defies all expectations, but their friends and family know their tremendous support is simply a reflection of the wonderful people they are. I feel privileged to know him and be involved in this type of uh, dedication to him. And obviously being a huge Florida State fan and having gone to school here, it makes you feel really good. My family's very excited for them, for us, for everyone who gets to come here. It's pretty cool. For students and staff at Florida State, it is fair to say their generosity has affected everyone in its path. And for Al and Judy, we're just happy to see that our money has been put to good use and that we are here to enjoy it. We were so excited to come here tonight to see it. And when we walked in the door, you have no idea the great feeling it gives you. It's our chance to tell them thank you. It's just a small way we're saying thank you. The university couldn't be prouder to have the Dunlaps, and the Champions Club that now bears their name has such an important role in the legacy of Florida State. I'm Gail Levy for Seminole Sports Magazine.